What's up, everyone? Today we're making soy sauce chow mein. My name is Randy, and I'm a second generation Chinese American on a mission to share and preserve my parents' recipes and stories, one meal at a time. My dad's been a Chinese chef for over 50 years, and by my estimates, he's made this dish well over 10,000 times during his career. Today, you'll get to learn all of his secrets for making the perfect soy sauce chow mein right at home. is a classic Cantonese dish that translates roughly to supreme soy sauce pan-fried noodles. During mealtime, my parents explained that this is traditionally more of a breakfast or lunch kind of dish, and especially popular for dim sum. Personally, I also found it really interesting that soy sauce chow mein is also typically served without meat. If you're interested in learning the traditional reasoning behind this, stay tuned for mealtime. For this dish, we'll be using about 12 ounces of Chinese egg noodles, of which there are many, many different types, varieties, and brands that offer them. For simplicity's sake, here are three of the most common Chinese egg noodles. Wantan mein, lo mein, and chao mein. We'll want to use chao mein, also known as Hong Kong-style pan-fried noodles. Chao mein is the ideal type of noodle for the traditional flavor and texture profile we're going for. They're thinner than lo mein and have less egg content than wonton mein. If you're looking for a written version of this recipe, check out our blog post at madewithloud.com where you'll find an adjustable list of ingredients and step-by-step -step videos to guide you as you make the recipe at home. For our sauce, we'll be mixing one tablespoon of dark soy sauce, one tablespoon of light soy sauce, one tablespoon of oyster sauce, two teaspoons of sugar, and one tablespoon of water. Mix until the sugar dissolves. As we wait for our noodles to steam, here's the backstory on our other key ingredient. Soy sauce. Soy sauce dates back to around 2200 years ago during the Han Dynasty in China. Much like congee and rice, soy sauce was originally developed to stretch salt, which used to be a very expensive commodity. It has since become one of the most common and important ingredients in all of Asian cuisine. In Cantonese, soy sauce is called si yao, and there are a ton of different names and variations for soy sauce all across Asia. 
Traditionally, Chinese soy sauce is produced by fermenting soybeans and grains, brewing with some sort of salt, purifying and pasteurizing, and then it's either stored for further aging or bottled immediately for distribution. It's primarily during this final step where dark soy sauce differs from light soy sauce. In Cantonese, dark soy sauce is known as lo tao, which roughly translates to old extract, a reference to a longer aging process than his younger brother, light soy sauce, or sang tao. Dark soy sauce is also commonly mixed with mushrooms, caramel coloring, and molasses. If you don't have dark soy sauce, you can skip it and substitute it with light soy sauce, which is generally easier to buy. You can also check our blog post and description for links to buy dark soy sauce online. I also wanted to make a special shout out to thank all of our wonderful Patreon supporters for helping bring this video to life. If you enjoy our videos and are interested in supporting us directly, head on over to patreon.com slash madewithlao to learn more. Now, if I tell you, why do you need to put it on the water and put it on the water? If you put it on the water and put it on the water, it will be a little bit easier. If you put it on the water and put it on the water, the water will turn red. If it turns red, the water will not be so sweet. It will 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 be so sweet. 啊，咩？如果蒸熟咗，沉咗落去啦，系嘛？开头好满噶，系咪？而家熟咗啦，嗱，搣开佢，如果条面系白色嘅咧，咁就唔就唔好熟。佢而家就 OK 啦，熟噶啦，完全熟噶啦。嗱，熟咗之后点咧？我哋再将啲面倒落呢度啲水嗰度，再倒落去，嗱，快快脆脆咁整起佢，嗱，搅一搅水佢，一分钟就得噶啦。嗱，得噶啦，好。倒落嚟，啊！哇！整松佢，咁嘅凍嚇，啊！蒸熟蒸過就啲面係爽啫嘛。如果你係煲熟直成係煮熟咧，啲面咧就腍啦，就冇咁好食啦，知道嘛？嗯。嗱，你試，佢就等佢去咁咧，去咁咧熱氣，凍一凍先炒，一兩分鐘咁啊就得噶啦，唔黐手嘅，而家摸落佢唔黐手嘅，嗱，好靚。Next, we'll heat our wok to around 350 to 400 degrees Fahrenheit, which should take a few minutes. Then we'll add about a tablespoon of corn oil and let that heat up until it's shimmering or forming ripples. We'll first put the corn oil and the corn oil in the pot. After the corn oil has been cooked and cooked, it will be hot. Let's first cook it. 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 We'll cook these for a little under a minute and then set them aside on a plate for later. Pa,开个好，唔好反佢，等佢慢慢，等佢煎香啲先，吓，慢慢先反，唔使咁快脆，系咁好简单嘅呀，等佢煎香佢，自然之后咧，就俾埋屙落啲芽菜，咁你俾
，反轉呢邊咧，再加多啲油落去。點解要俾油？要有啲油煎佢先得，煎得佢啲面香啊嘛。呢邊反轉呢邊底下已經有油煎啊嘛。我反正嗰邊你亦都要有油煎先得嘅，係咪？聽到香啦。如果有油咧，煎咧佢煎得香，呀都香香啦，係咪？嗱，嗱，正面入邊咧，下邊好香啦，實實相響係咪？如果唔係嘅，佢唔會響噶，唔係嗰響法噶。點咧？有啲有啲蒸氣出嚟，煎咧有啲蒸氣出嚟。嗱，睇到嘛？有啲蒸氣咁出嚟，係嘛？我而家就整鬆佢啊。整上佢，炒豉油黃炒面，炒碟炒出嚟碟面要乾爽咁先好食。如果唔係咧，黐埋黐埋一嚿就唔好食啦。先阿爹哋啊，如果炒呢啲面咧，有有啲人冇我哋呢啲唔黐底嘅鍋，咁啲鍋又冇咩即係特別要求啊嘛。炒呢個面唔會黐鍋嘅。就算用其他鍋都唔會黐面，你唔黐鍋呢個面，<笑>因為你啲面係硬咗、蒸熟咗、硬咗嘅。如果你係嗰啲啊咁俾啲水淥熟嗰啲面，真係會黐。嗱，蒸嗰啲面咧就唔會黐鍋嘅。第一個咧，燒你只鍋好熱，燒到好熱先至俾油。咁種炒咧，佢就唔佢就唔會黐鍋嘅。如果你燒到只鍋未熱咧，就俾啲油落去咧，咁炒咧就黐緊黐鍋。好，我哋而家咧。俾啲芽菜落去隔離，煮煮啲芽菜佢，一一個邊嗰度煮咗佢。哦，未撈埋啊？未，等佢煮咗佢先，等佢底下，擺喺底啲芽菜喺底下煮咗佢先。嗱，你都反正上去，俾啲面喺底下，啲芽菜喺底下，咁咪得咯。嗯，嗱嗱，咁就 OK 啦。聽到芽菜響啊！ Let the bean sprouts cook underneath the noodles for about 30 to 45 seconds. 好啦，俾埋嗰啲葱尾落去。头先炒好嗰啲洋葱同埋葱白，俾埋落去。We'll mix this around and separate the noodles for about one to two minutes. 铺头搞好啲啲豉油，啲果子咧，我而家倒埋佢落去啦，吓。After pouring the sauce, we'll mix it around for another minute. Ah, yeah, 差唔多，再煮一个干身啲，炒干身啲佢就得噶啦。而家成日系开猛火啊，开猛火，一定要开猛火。For additional flavor, we'll add about one teaspoon of sesame oil. From here, we'll continue mixing and fluffing the noodles for about two more minutes, and then we'll be just about done. You come go home. Hmm. 好香口。嗱，如果睇到落去咧，如果你認為呢度仲未夠顏色嘅，加多五滴老抽落去，佢會黑啲。豉油黃啊嘛，豉油黃炒面，俾多半個老抽落去，啲顏色會深啲噶啦，佢會深色啲噶啦嚇。嗰啲老抽唔會好鹹噶，呀，冇嗰啲生抽咁鹹嗱。而家咪深色啲啦，係咪？所以你一定要睇下炒好之後咧。你認為佢顏色唔夠深嘅，你加多少少老抽落去，嗱得噶啦，完全得噶啦，好出得，同學阿姐 ，yes， 冇錯啦姐 ，no， 等你食豉油黃炒麵啊，啊，得嘅，得噶啦，叫佢嚟食啊，好大條嘅呢度，嚇，十二安子嘅嘅嘅面就整得好大條噶啦，好，豉油黃炒麵就搞掂啦。你話 ，Yeah， 誒，睇到啊 ，OK， 食得，豉油黃炒面 ，OK， 唔多食面 ，Thank you for your help，Oh yes，OK，I've been waiting， 咁多條貓咪一齊食 ，OK， 食飯。Oh my god, I can put this whole piece in my mouth. Daddy say, you made thousands and thousands of dollars. Oh really? He said thousands and thousands of this dish. He walks so many restaurants, to the dim sum restaurant, fast food restaurant, local residency restaurant. Also, we own a restaurant. All those years. 
Many, many, many times. It's popular wherever you go. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. A lot of people wanted to know, how do you get the right texture? In the market, you can buy wet noodles. Yeah. One it is cooked, one it is uncooked. Mm -hmm. So the, un the cooked one is called steamed mm -hmm. noodle, the uncooked noodle is called sangmin. These are both fresh though. They're just fresh. Mm -hmm. But they both wet. Okay. Both wet. They're not dry. Not dry. But in the package. For chow mein, it should be dish up in the whole thing. Mmm,那個那個質地是它本身濕了嘛。濕過好過乾了咯。乾的如果好多地方唔買都都濕嘅咪用乾嘅。乾嘅都OK啊。How do you get the perfect texture if you start with dry ones? 煲滾咗水,倒啲油上去,即係機油上去呢,煮個煮咗個麵嘅時候佢唔會黐埋咯。攪散佢。一攪散唔好煮得太遲,長時間一滾咗之後一兩分鐘。If you do the boiled ones, is it better to use it right, like boil it and use it right away? Really? Oh, if somebody has their noodles clumped together too much, how do you solve that? Well, then how can you solve it? If you first cook the noodles before you cook the noodles, you don't want to cook it. If you cook the noodles before you cook the noodles, you can't cook it. You have to cook it before you cook it before you cook it. Oh my god. Yeah, 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 Oh, how come this dish doesn't come without meat usually? This is from a Patreon supporter. Patreon supporter, the pangs. <laughs> 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 It's about the flavor first. Like, yeah, you're calling it the flavor. Yeah, so rather than beef, then it's yeah. like, that's not that's the pork flavor. Yeah. Ah, very good. Interesting. Like, that's simple, right? Yeah, this is not just the the <笑>西游王西游面水素王面倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾倾
，好似我屋企慢慢咁俾佢落煎煎煎煎到煎，佢出咗兩個餐咯，餐館都面都係咁樣蒸過嘅。不過嗰個餐館做咧就用落好多油，佢俾燒啲油咁兩煎兩炸香兩邊。倒翻嚟，乾乾啲油，乾乾油倒落去，再啲啲咩嘅鑊水鑊嗰度，搓兩搓佢，咁啊啲乾水呢度再鑊，俾啲啊俾啲洋葱啊，咁啊抽抽就再倒落去，咁未炒。咁啊搓水係咪搓水？一個咧就煮翻淋啲面，一個咧就去翻啲去誒煮葱金啲油去。嗯、um, ，When you're making at home, can you ever use too much oil？ 係啊，用就唔會用好多油，不過俾。比平時嘅炒面用多啲咁多油咯。炒粉炒面都係。炒粉炒面一一定係多啲油。一定係多油啊！如果唔多油，唔好食。Can you do it? Can can. Yummy. Is it good? 你覺得你面好啲定係餐館面好啲？不如講餐館，第第一餐館有餐館嘅做法，我有我嘅做法，我做就健康啲。我覺得餐館咧油多，浸曬喺個碟度咁嘅。但係餐館佢個鍋氣啊，個鍋氣可能比屋企會好啲，因為我哋呢啲呢啲爐咧係好難 produce 好多鍋氣嘅。餐館唔係哦，哇！餐館啊，你睇下嗰嗰啲火爐，啲火嘣嘣升上嘅，自然就整咗好多鍋氣，咁會香好多。但係屋企咧會 healthy 啲，即係唔好咁啊，好似食咗完又喉嚨痛啊。又覺得油太多啊，咁唔會有呢個問題。We've touched on this in some of our previous videos, but wok hei is an important principle in Cantonese cooking. The Cantonese word hei is more commonly known by its Mandarin counterpart, qi, the vital life force that runs through our body. Wok hei has a lot of different meanings, but I love how Grace Young explains it in her book, The Breath of a Wok, and how the wok breathes its energy into the food to create an epic meal. Kenji Lopez Alt, a popular science-based chef and author, recently posted a great write-up on the New York Times about the elements of wok hei, which centers around the reactions that occur between sugars, oils, extreme heat, and rapid evaporation. Achieving restaurant-quality wok hei at home is generally harder due to the heat limitations of our typical stoves. Home-cooked food still tastes great even without a high-powered heat source. But if you're curious, I highly recommend checking out Kenji's video where he shares his own version of lo mein noodles. Made at home with a blowtorch to get more of that smoky, fleeting wok hei essence. But right now, our goal is to make everybody easy, <laughs> healthy to like for our lunch, for mm -hmm. our breakfast, for family. Yeah, for yeah. family. But go le, we 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 now we now do is to teach our friends how to make at home. Anyway, you eat out, I feel like I'm happy. That will be good, I think. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yay! 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 <laughs> Hello, thank you for watching today's dish, Xiyang Wang Chao Mian. This dish is really, really delicious. I believe everyone easy to learn this noodle and cook this noodle at home. Uh, thank you again. Give us a like, share, and subscribe and support. Thank you. Kim Kim say, Thank you, everyone. Kim Kim. Thank you, everyone. Kim -kim. See you next time. Thank you. Say bye. Bye bye. Where's my banana? Where's my banana? Yeah. Where's Kim -kim. my banana? Say bye bye.